And uh, on the onset, I think we, as our naturally students in JNU and across uh, our state and in the country, I think we we really have to condemn what happened, the state brutality, you know, uh, that were, that happened in Northeast Assam, in particular, in Tripura, in Meghalaya, and especially what we witnessed in Jamia and Aligarh Muslim University. And uh, I hope today my voice will not be dubbed by some other people. I bring my voice to you as an Arunachali also. So it is a sincere request. Aaj mujhe baat karne do. Aaj suno hume kya bolna hai. It is so sad that only we understand only bloodshed. Jab khun baha tabhi samaj mein aaya. But we have been fighting this cause for so long, but no one wanted to listen to us. Aaj jab khun baha to sabko aaya. Ki, this is bad, you know. What happened in Aligarh, what happened in uh, Jamia, it's highly condemnable. But I would also like to bring to your notice that when Manipur University mein armies brought in tanks, it was sad to see the reaction. No one understood, no one came out on the streets, and this is what happens. And it is so sad that Northeastern, our lives are always sidelined. But when I come out to speak, I'll be termed so fast xenophobic. Itna easily aap, matlab, bol dete hai, these people are xenophobic. You know? And when we come as collective, even the very idea of critical thinking, bolo, jo bolo, agar hum bole, to what is the word that's been famous right now? Ethnophasicist. Is that what this is about? My very, I have a very, um, very fundamental question today to my fellow JNUites because I have faith in this university and its students and also to the larger Indians across India I want to ask you today what is unity in diversity is it your forceful assimilation of everything northeast ko zabarjasti banalo hame bas ek tourism placard mein laga do that we are unity in diversity hamara bas music festival uh, you know, propagate just that. Is it just about that? No, it's not. Today I want to say that within that, beyond that is our concern. And I want to ask you, will you fight with us? Will you listen to our voice? Will you listen to the Nishis, the Adi, Apatani, Mizos, Nagas, the Butias, the Lepchas, the Assamese, the Boros, Khasi, Garo, the Maites, and so many other ethnic tribes? Are you ready to listen is my question today. Or is India only fighting for the coal in Meghalaya, the petroleum in Assam, the famous Assam tea, or just the hydropower of our natural? It's my question to you today. I just want to incite this thought on you. This CAA, this bill that has been passed to act, it does not have just one dimension. And please, it is a request. Listen to us as well. Before you term us entirely xenophobic, Please give out a voice, listen to us, is my um, thought today. And what happened cannot be accepted in any form, not in Jamia, not in AMU, not in Manipur University, not across any universities or to any protesters all over the country. This is a democracy and we have the right and we will protest till our voices are heard. Thank you so much for coming and thank you for listening to me.